Thank you, Chris. Okay, what type of traveler are you? Uh, that's a key question that, thanks to a quiz online you can take, will help you really narrow down and give you just the ultimate vacation, if you may be thinking about that, into the summer. Tamala Rich, our travel guru, is here <laughs> to talk all about that. Yeah. This is, I wouldn't think to take a quiz to really narrow this down ahead of time, but what a great idea. Thank you. So how does this all work? So if everybody gets a little bit of what they want in a vacation, you okay. really reduce the whining, right? Yes, true. <laughs> and you increase the happiness quotient. Mm -hmm. So I designed this traveler type quiz and it, ga it gauges you on what you like to do when you travel and who you are as a traveler. Okay. So if you're going with, say, a group of three to four people, all of those folks need to take this quiz. Right. In order Order to determine what the best place to go is. Right, and so okay. then you can compare your scores. Gotcha. Yeah, sure. So, for example, you told me before before we went on that you are a cultural foodie traveler. Um, I've been known to be <laughs> liking food a little bit here and there. So, for example. <laughs> Uh, I have a link on my website. You can get these terrific um, maps, for example. Okay. In Kentucky, we got the Bourbon Trail map. In South okay. Carolina, we got a, a drink map and a barbecue trail map. Mm. Um, there's all kinds of ways. Once you know what you want to zero in on, so right. you can you know, really get the things you like. Okay. Another example, let's talk about what, what the politicians call flyover states. Okay. So those are usually like the plains. Mm -hmm. um, uh, Kansas and Oklahoma, for example. You might not think of those as, as vacations, right? Uh, right. But now that we know that you're a foodie traveler, um, you know you can you can get them to send you gorgeous brochures and links to resources to help you enjoy their state. Uh -huh. So, for example, if you were a cultural traveler, look, who would think that Oklahoma that had all that rhythm and blues? Rhythm and blues are so much in history and yeah. then if you are a scholarly traveler mm -hmm. you might be interested in the genealogy trail that they have out ah. there the um, African American history trail that they have Native American cultural stuff Wow okay all and they'll send that for free? free you just go online tell them what you want and this is also the kind of thing to stop at welcome centers and get. oh yeah of course They're, you kind of bypass that little uh, area where never they have all the stop. birds. Yeah. yeah, never bypass the welcome yeah, centers. Yeah, they've These got a lot of good info really there. Know what they're talking about. Sure, yeah. sure. Okay, so when they go online and take your quiz, they you get a printout that yes. personalizes based on your answers. Yes, uh, they'll tell you here's what you like and here's okay. where you score high and where you score low, and it's got links to all the state tourism authorities. Okay, where you can you know, start your search. And uh, this little book might help too as well, right? This is my new book, Hit the Road: A Woman's Guide to Solo Motorcycle Touring. Oh yeah, and it's built around your traveler type. Oh cool, very cool. Go find her, TamilaRich.com, right? Thank you. Yes, we'll be is. right back. Mm -hmm.